Hey guys. So when editing and uploading this video, I realized that there was an honest trailer for it that was less than two minutes long. So if this video is not long like the normal ones, understand. I'm reacting to a video that came out in 2012 and is like a minute and 56 seconds long. So let's just hop into this. But first, this video is sponsored by me and my company, Fresh Coffee Bean Company. Luxury USA roasted coffee delivered to your front door. Whether you're in a mood for a different type of coffee, a unique coffee mug, a travel cup, or even a new coffee machine, I have exactly what you need all in one place. Just be sure to sign up to our email list to receive 10% off of your first order. I am so excited to introduce my baby to you guys. I know you will love it. And once you make your purchase, be sure to leave a review. Let me know what you think about the products. All the information you need about the store will be found in the description bar below. And without further ado, on with the video. From the horse face director who starts shooting before finishing scripts, based on a children's cartoon designed to sell toys comes a movie designed to sell toys. Because it's not the same narrator as the ones that have come out recently. When this dude was doing the narration for these Honest trailers, I wasn't a huge fan of it because it's just a certain feeling that you get listening to the, the more recent guy than this guy. But we'll finish it because we're already in it. Toys you can't even tell apart, except for the black one. This looks like a cool place to kick it. Together, they will unite with this stuttering teenager. No, 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 to defeat a bad guy who doesn't appear until almost two hours into the movie. Let me know in the comments below if you guys had been watching Honest Trailers since 2012, or even when they first started. I'm just saying this video came out in 2012, so I'm just totally judging that according to what has come out recently. But let me know. When I was doing the Twilight Honest Trailer, which I will be eventually reacting to very soon because it was just funny as heck, I don't remember the year that came out, but the guy that was doing the narration for that is the most recent guy now something about his feelings and emotions and the way his voice just works with the re with the mood of the video just works more for this this guy's voice just doesn't give me the feeling of being in the mood of hearing his commentary if you got what i'm saying let me know in the comments below if you guys been following on this trailer for a while in the meantime there's gratuitous porny shots of megan fox weird racism hey mommy and robot fights that erupt around random hot girls Michael Bay was trying to pork. This summer, you will say, what the hell is happening? I was thinking that a lot. When you're watching the fight scenes, they're actually really enjoyable to watch. And with the sound effects of the machines, as well as the scenes where the, like, the machines are fighting, one, there were some times where I didn't know what was happening, honestly. Like I couldn't tell who was who and if the bad guy was fighting the good guy or if something was exploding. It was kind of confusing. They just etched in the sound effects of the machines as well as with the music. They just put it together really well. But there was a few times where I was watching and like, uh, am I looking at two machines fighting? Or I don't know What's happening right now? Till they give the bad guy the thing he wants. Give me that cube. And then it kills him. Seriously, it's fing stupid. Starry, Burger King, Panasonic, eBay, Cadillac, GMC, The Strokes, Pepto Bismol, Xbox, Furbies, Pontiac, Mountain Dew, Chevrolet, Chevrolet, and introduce. I don't know if this was more shoehorned in with the product placement than Jurassic World. Chevrolet, Battleship, I, I, I mean, Transformers. <laughs> Come on, they both look the same. Oh man, the Ninja Turtles are fucked. Based on the tragedy that spawned thousands of heartbreaking... Tra wow, watching the older ones, it's just really interesting seeing how much they have transformed their intros, outros, I don't know, it's just really cool to just look back at what got me into watching 
Honest trailers. And then I noticed over here, the Honest trailer for Twilight, which I will be doing very soon, because it's very, very funny. I didn't think it was completely necessary to add in my own opinion when it comes to this. I just kind of want to see what the Transformers Honest trailers brought to the surface compared to what Pitch Meetings did, because they're, they're more analyzing the film and just bringing in outside information as opposed to Ryan George and the Pitch Meetings, which is more commentary. But I'm very excited to have noticed that they have done this, but it's just really shocking that it's so short. But I'm okay with that because this came out of nowhere and I realized this is a good opportunity for me to react to both just to get an opinion, well two opinions on the same film from two totally different channels. So hope you guys enjoyed that. Alright guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, definitely give it a thumbs up. If you really like it, definitely subscribe. Let me know in the comments below, are you a fan of Honest Trailers? Do you notice the difference in the feelings of the Honest Trailers from the narrator from back then compared to the one that's doing narration now? Let me know in the comments below. Also, if you guys are not aware, I have a Patreon, three to four tiers. Check out all the information will be linked in the description bar below if you decide you want to support my content. It'll be very awesome, honestly, because I I want to grow and give you guys a lot more content and by supporting me on patreon you'll be able to see exclusive content that will only be seen on patreon so again link in the description bar below if you want to know more about that also also if you guys love my face and enjoy my content you know what to do and I'll see you all in the next video